On a very rainy Thursday, the Vu family took a break from searching and turned their attention to the Manitowoc County Courthouse. I'm your Lakeshore neighborhood reporter Preston Stober with the latest on the case against Elijah Vu's mother and her partner. Police say Jesse Vang was the man who reported Elijah Vu missing. He's facing a child neglect charge. And Thursday, without an appointed attorney, his case was delayed again. Vang had this to say. Judge Robert Dwayne said Vang is set to get an attorney and he'll need to make his demand for a speedy trial in writing. Katrina Bauer's attorney said she's waiving her right to a preliminary hearing in the state's requirement to offer probable cause for a felony. Bauer has also been charged with child neglect. Do you understand that by waiving that right, you're relieving the state of having to make those proofs? Yes. Can you speak out, ma'am? I can't hear you. Yes. Okay. A um, day that answered what's next in court for Bauer and Vang, but no answers for locals, like Cheryl Brown, still searching for Elijah. How can we all just sit here and knowing where is that little boy? Somebody needs to tell us whether he's gone or he's here. I think that's a big question for everybody right now. I first met Cheryl on a search two weeks ago, and she still joins the search parties as often as she can. Praying that someday, somebody, I'll wake up and I'll hear he's okay. <laughs> yep. I can say that that emotion you saw from Cheryl was shared by multiple people in the courthouse after the hearing. Vang is expected back in court on the 21st for his preliminary hearing, whereas Bauer will be back in court on the 22nd of March for her arraignment at 4 o'clock. I'm told that the Vu family search will be off on Thursday and Friday, but will continue on Saturday and Sunday. And the plan is to search again next week. In Manitowoc, Preston Stober, NBC 26.